First Updates Now videos are brought to you by Stryker. Discover why so many first alumni and mentors are putting Stryker first when it comes to their careers, internships, and co-ops. Visit careers.stryker.com forward slash first to learn more. Hello, I'm David Hilker with First Capital RI3D, and today we'll be looking at how to uh, pretty much weld these polycord belts together. So right now we have this little rig here um, to hold things in place uh, so that we can use our heat gun here to applicate heat to the area and then use a bar here to push it down and make sure that it sticks flat. So we like using the uh, two by one stocks here keeps everything level we'll put that under there and then secure those ends down under there and then have these weighting that on top so that they meet in the middle here now when measuring out your polycord uh, I like to measure it to about the exact distance that you need and then cut it there and then overlap it about a good quarter inch uh, maybe more depending on your needs so once you have it all secured and lined up there, then you'll take your heat gun and apply heat to the area. I like to do this for about a minute. David, why don't you talk about what we use yep. this for while we wait for the heat? Yep. So this is going to be a f uh, very useful uh, this year, uh, looking at um, a lot of these mechanisms going back to like 2012 and such. Uh, the linear indexing, uh, taking the balls up from the uh, intake to the shooter mechanism is going to be a great challenge this year. Um, so instead of having to run a ton of wheels, you can just have a simple belt run uh, taking the ball right up there. Okay. So make sure that the pieces are catching here. And once they're pretty nice and melted along here, then we can turn off the heat gun, get our bar, push it down, apply good pressure for somewhere around 15 seconds here. And together they'll fuse on the one end uh, and create that secure connection. After that, we'll be able to flip it over, melt the other end and do the same to the other side. As you, yep. As you can see right there, that's created a really secure connection there. You might want to avoid putting it over a hole next time. <laughs> and with that, it's time to flip it over to the next side and do the same. Thanks for watching. If you want more fun content, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. You can also directly help support fun by visiting our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash first updates now or by subscribing at twitch.tv forward slash first updates now. Thanks to all of our co-executive producers on Patreon and tier two plus subscribers on Twitch keeping fun loud, live, and independent. Thanks to Rev Robotics and all of our First Capital RA3D sponsors.